So yeah, the spraying was sort of coming along reasonably well. This was all supposed to be farmed out to another firm, uh, but they've let me down. Uh, so I've got to do the, the, the bank out. These are the drawers from the bank out, and I've got to do the big box myself as well. I just realised I'm wearing white in a predominantly white space. I'm just going to do this sort of floating head. Um, uh, today's quick video anyway, we're just going to go back to, uh, I paid my dad a quick visit last year and uh, we came across one of my school projects and I thought it would uh, be interesting to take a quick look at that. So I'm just up north for a couple of nights visiting my dad and one of the things that I've come across while I'm here is uh, something I made for my mum and dad when I was 16. This is the last of my school woodworking projects. Um, it's not bad. Can't quite tell what it is. Might be birch, might be oak. Uh, it's been recovered a couple of times. My mum was a soft furnishing whiz. Uh, I, I'm not, I've got to say some of the joints are a little bit, uh, little bit gappy, but I'm not totally convinced I could do any better today, at least not by hand. For a little school woodworking project when I was 16. Oh, well pleased with that. That's, uh, yeah, over 40 years old. <laughs> it's amazing that's lasted as well as it has. Uh, yeah, fantastic. So yeah, that was uh, just about the last sort of school woodworking project that I did and I'm amazed that my parents still have it, my dad still has it. Uh, amazed that it's lasted as long as it has. When you actually look at the joins closely, they're not bad, they're not great, but they're not bad. Uh, I don't think I could hand cut anything as, as well as that without a bit more practice now. Uh, and I hate to think how long it actually took me to do, but uh, interesting nonetheless. I hope you find it interesting anyway. Uh, if you did, give it a thumbs up, share it freely, and don't forget to subscribe, then you'll be notified. Whenever I put up something new, hey, just check back on a Friday, when there's always something new up at noon. I'll see you then. Take care.